Coverage now of an officer on trial. Can you believe it? We are just nine days away now from the sentencing of former Spokane police officer Carl Thompson. And tonight we know much more about what federal prosecutors will try to use to land Thompson more time in jail. KXY4's Melissa Luck is here with court documents just filed yesterday. Now the feds want Thompson to serve at least nine years in prison for using excessive force and violating Otto Zem's civil rights. Thompson's attorneys want no jail time at all. What the new court documents show is that prosecutors plan to use more than just the facts of the crime to put Thompson behind bars. Prosecutors say Thompson used a dangerous weapon, obstructed justice, and abused his position of power that night in 2005. They also described Thompson's actions as a violent preemptive assault. They want the judge to consider the broader implications of this case on our community. They cite the erosion of public trust, specifically that the election of Mayor David Condon proves that the city wants significant change in police oversight. They cite the, fa the fact that Thompson was, at the time, a candidate for the open police chief position, saying that the department wanted him cast in a more positive light. And they want the judge to consider what this has cost the city financially, including a $2 million settlement with the Zem family and the half million dollars the city spent for Carl Thompson's defense. Prosecutors also say this case and Zem's treatment have had a devastating effect on the mentally ill in our community, making them fearful of our police department. Whether or not those factors are considered is up to a federal judge at Thompson's sentencing on November 15th. In the newsroom, I'm Melissa Luck, KXOY4 HD News.